This is gonna be totally awesome. <laughs> Welcome back to Endzone. Today we are joined by Jaden and Sam from Goodnight Nurse. Welcome, my friends. Hello. Hey, yeah. How's it going? Good. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Must be pretty awesome because you guys have just released your second album. Yeah. Get me on your side. Yeah, it's really exciting. You know, it's been quite a long process, but um, it's good to finally have it out. Never thought I'd be making a second album, so it's cool. Really? Why is yeah. that? Oh, just because the first one was so crap. Then, um, <laughs> <laughs> nah, I guess I don't know. I never even thought we'd be making our first album when I started the band. We were so useless, and just <laughs> but we eventually, you know, got some songs together, and it's cool, you know, to be able to make a second album and to have a back catalogue of two albums. <laughs> so yeah. Would you, would you agree with Jaden Sam? I think he's being amazingly modest here, but um, no, I mean, well, I'm only a bit of a newbie. I joined about February last year, okay. um, but no, it's been awesome for me to be able to come along and get a semi-professional band and turn them into an amazingly positive. <laughs> band, so. so I'll be the humble guy and he can be the cocky guy yeah, for the interview. Right. Yeah. Yeah. One of you could be like the angel and the other could be the yeah. devil yeah. on the show yeah. for you, yeah, something like that. <laughs> um, oh, sorry. No, you, you go. Okay. So, um, so tell us about the album. Um, obviously, you've had a lineup change or a couple of lineup yes. changes. Yep. Um, have you taken a new direction? with that, that line change? Yeah, yeah um, it was just like a natural progression. We wanted to um, evolve like with our fans get older and we got older ourselves so we we're writing about new things, experiencing different stuff and um, yeah the music just kind of naturally evolved from that. We didn't sit down and go okay we want to like do this kind of music now. Mm. We guess that they sat down and wrote songs and they just yeah came out like as a natural progression from the last album. Yeah. So, so when you say you're writing about new things kind of what is um you know what, what's uh, pertinent to Good Night News at the moment? What's kind of well, I don't know like just like I guess Guess, like as you get older in life more stuff happens to you like um, good stuff and bad stuff and you've just so kind of like when we wrote our first album we were just teenagers and we just got drunk went to parties and wrote about girls and and there's still a bit of that on the album like you know fun songs but you know there's been other stuff that you know more deep stuff and just hey, yeah there's just more to write about because you've been on the planet longer so yeah because I was going to say for the um, for the, the first video uh, for, for the night for the yeah. single sorry yeah. um, there is a bit of a party scene going on there, yeah, but it's yeah. not its not all fun and frivolity, is it? Yeah, no, it's kind of like, um, well, that song's just kind of about, about um, it's called The Night, so it's just about me and Joel and, you know, you know these guys, like, just the lifestyle of being in a band and, you know, being out late, not having to get up early and do a day job and partying and just, yeah, being a derelict <laughs> musician, pretty much. <laughs> so, yeah. Does it, get, does it get a bit tiresome, would you say? Um, you love it? No, nah, a little bit, a little bit. But no, nah, it's it's tiresome in the sense that um, I mean, what Jaden missed out on is that like most of the things that we do as musicians are at night time, okay. whether that's just playing shows or just travelling from one town to the next kind of thing. So that's kind of what the, like most of the songs about sort of things. So it's tiresome in the sense that you don't really get um, your you know your necessary eight hours of sleep, but it's always exciting. So it's always cool. Yeah. Fulfilling. Yeah, exactly. So um, let's talk about some of the songs on the album. Um, I've noticed uh, that some of the al uh, the track titles are quite dark. Is it more of a dark kind of direction than um, uh, um, Always and Ever? Um, not really. Um, the kind of the, the artwork and that and the song titles, yeah, probably um, come across that way. But I think it's just a more there's a good mix. Mm. Like. Um, there is some dark songs, but um, not so much in the music, more just lyrically the, there's some darker songs, but um, yeah, there's quite a, like a good mix of like, you know, fun songs, light-hearted songs and more meaningful songs. So I wouldn't say it's like a darker album than our first album. It's probably a little bit more poppier, but like poppier in a different way, not so like cheesy bubblegum pop. Mm. It's just, yeah, a little bit more. Yeah. It's kind of Feel for takeover to Yeah, it's, um, it's, it's not like the songs have gotten darker, it's more the content and lyrical content's gotten a little bit more serious in that sense. So the music itself is kind of, we've really, you know, just gotten into melody and song structure and stuff like that, so it's popular in that sense. But in terms of lyrical content, it's more about serious, not issues, but you know, like what Jaden was saying that. Um, we just emotive to, yeah, style more, lyrics yeah, rather than... Yeah, yeah. More, more emotive and just thinking about 
kind of like everyday issues and stuff like that, but just from a different angle and whatnot. So it's a bit more deeper and more serious in that sense, but then the music's a little bit lighter, so it kind of quite a good juxtaposition kind of thing. All right, so um, let's have a we look at this puppy. Okay. Keep me on your side. Yes. This is this actually a, a promo. This copy. is actually a promo copy of the album. The um, actual um, copy of the album is a lot flasher and has a hologram cover and a free T-shirt. A free T-shirt. Yeah, I'm actually wearing it, but um, I can't yeah. get it off. No, get it off. It's not a free T-shirt. It's a, this is just a plain black T-shirt. So it's not a plain black T-shirt. <laughs> um, yeah. Well, the album's out at the moment. And you can get um, oh, there's like a limited edition. Um, hologram cover and you can get a t-shirt for it as well. It's pretty flash. Uh, yeah, so it's pretty exciting. It's cool to have it out there and yeah. What does the animal head represent? Because that's in the uh, end of your video as well. Yeah, it? um, it's kind of like, it doesn't really represent anything. Um, it represents good night nurse. So it's just where I had this concept of artwork and it, yeah, we Is just thought it a rat or a cool. kangaroo? It's, it's, um, it's, it's a, a space kangaroo. Ah. It's a doe. No, it's actually, yeah, it's a deer. A doe. Yeah. Female deer. Deer. A, a young deer, but it doesn't actually look like one because it's kind of got big ears and big <laughs> space eyes. That's awesome. And it's just floating in an, in an abyss of blackness. <laughs> so yeah, it doesn't really mean anything. Yeah. Look, uh, Jaden and Sam from uh, Good Night Nurse, thank you so much for joining us today on Endzone. And we're going to check thank out a uh, new video by you guys. Would you like to introduce it for us? Yes, uh, this is our latest single, The Night, off our album Keep You On Your Side, in stores now. It was directed by our good friend Jonathan Gerard, and it's very sexy, so enjoy. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> thank you. Nice.